What's going on guys, Gadgets123, we are back on the on the road to 100 subs, so <laughs> hopefully you guys are enjoying our videos, hopefully you guys are enjoying um, everything we're posting, and if you're at least getting entertainment out of it, then I'm happy about that. Alright guys, hopefully you guys seen our previous video for the um, wireless charger vehicle dock, it's actually a generic brand, really good really good charger but that's on the previous video so hopefully you guys check it out check that re uh, unboxing of that item and um, why we recommend it why it's so good but right now we have another um, dock well it's not a dock it's, a, it's an air vent card mount so this is the uh, air, vent, air vent car mount that kind of got stuck there so this is another one that it's actually pretty good in Amazon right now it's uh, for Four and a half out of five stars, which is actually pretty good for a vent mount. Um, it goes for around nine dollars um, uh, via Prime, which is actually pretty good. So if you're looking for a, um, you're not, you don't like those um, regular mounts, and you, 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 you know, you enjoy having those vent mounts, then the, this one I think is actually pretty good for about nine bucks. I think it, you know you're getting a nice um, solid uh, vent mount. Um, I'm actually, I mean, I'm personally, I'm recommending the ones that, um, uh, let me rephrase that. Um, you know, we have the regular mounts and then we have the vent mounts. Vent mounts are good. Like they're okay. They're, they're pretty, pretty good. Um, you know, depending again on the, the strength of the bang is some of them are light and weaker than others. Um, I'm actually liking more the ones with the actual arms and the legs and the, and the stents more than the actually the actual magnetic ones because for some reason the magnetic ones yes are they're easy to put in and, and remove and which is cool but I don't know I, I, I especially with the, the the more expensive phones nowadays you know if you, if you get about a thousand dollars worth of uh, phone equipment and um, and that magnetic um, um, grip is not strong enough for in your phone in your in your phone falls you know there could be a chance that you crack it or you know something happens or you dent it i don't know whatever and that's going to cause you that's going to be a headache so um i like these because they have the little arms and the legs which is actually pretty cool they're, i believe they're more reliable personally in my opinion you might think otherwise but um i you know, I already tested a couple of them out, and I do like, and they don't actually move. I've seen the magnetic, magnetic ones sometimes when you put the, the actual phone on it, kind of, you know, if you make a sharp turn, it's going to, like, kind of rotate, and you have to put it back into into place. So, again, that's for another video. Right now, we're going to do an unboxing on this MPOW Grip Flex Air Vent Car Mount. Generic mount, nothing special on it. It's just a vent mount with the um, grip um, arms and legs so we're gonna open it again it goes for about 10 uh, not even eight bucks in Amazon so pretty simple all you do get is the mount it's already you know nothing else not even instructions damn <laughs> so um, it's two pieces it's already pre-connected so again if you ever had a mount before it's pretty standard nothing crazy you pull this out and then um, you can put it back in and then tighten it up and this will tighten up the um, actual um, you know the actual mount itself so it doesn't kind of wiggle from left to right or up and down all right so it does have um, legs and arms the legs as you could see they kind of curve up so which is good kind of kind of grips the phone and the arms um, have like foamy um, like smooth foamy arms the legs also have kind of foam on them, so it kind of grips the phone a little bit better. Which I do like is the, it, it has a button in the back like the other models do, so the arms could open. But check this out. <laughs> it doesn't, it's not like that crappy, you know, like uh, for instance, the, um, the other model I was doing, this one. Um, when you press a button, it just clicks, you know, clicks open, like, like kind of cheaply, cheaply done. This one... Seems like one of those, um, I don't know, uh, one of those, um, um, uh, like more, um, more um, expensive uh, mounts because, like, when you press it, it doesn't even make a noise. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, seems like one of those um, automated doors you see on, on movies. It just, you know, 
you know, just press the button and opens and closes, like back in Star Trek and stuff. That's pretty cool. Anyways, it is pretty solid. It is pretty hard to close, which is actually good. Um, the bottom part, I mean, the the back where the mount goes, I mean, where where the um, with the little like rubbery um, arms go on the vent is actually pretty thick and it's pretty hard to open so for instance I have this um, Dunkin Donuts gift card so if if I try to kind of push it in there it's hard to push it in which in a way it's actually good because it's gonna hold the amount uh, pretty uh, sturdy uh, on the vent itself so like they say these are the vents when you put the um, mount you kind of have to use the smaller like grooves here when you push it in it's really hard to push it in which in turn it's actually a good thing because it's gonna hold the phone to, it's gonna hold the mount uh, pretty nicely on the mount itself so keep that in mind it's actually well made I do like the way it's made in the back so that's actually a plus on this now we're gonna put a phone so for our test we're gonna put an S8 plus it's one of the bigger phones I have right now with me let me tighten it up and again we're gonna do the dreaded shake test guy <laughs> all right I know again I explained this in my previous videos you're not going off road or anything but I do like to do these shake tests because the only reason I do is because um, you're putting on a 10 20 30 dollar mount a thousand dollar phone okay so if you're putting a thousand dollar phone on a mount wouldn't you want it to be, you know, at least, you know, do as much testing as you as you possibly can? Because if that phone cracks, you're like, especially on this S8, and this is not even the newer ones. Like you got the S9, the Note 9, and so forth. You know, you you're looking at about four hundred dollars in in repairs on a new screen. You know, if something happens, you know, like it drops and it it hits you know awkwardly and it which always happens for some weird reason and you know then you're pretty much asked out in other words so you know I do these little tests not as a uh, you know I know you're not gonna hit like anything crazy but just to 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 show you that it's actually the arms actually do work like they're pretty solid so you got you know you get into an accident which hopefully you know god forbid you you, you don't but something happens you, you 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 do a fender bender or something and the phone's not gonna go flying out and stuff you know so we're doing the shake test on this phone real quick solid guys solid i i don't see i don't see it falling out it moved a little bit that's it nothing crazy look at that i i i'm doing it backwards it should be falling out this way now it did. It took a it took a long time for it to fall out. Um, I do like how sturdy it is. So let's say you're hitting you know you're hitting a couple bumps here and there, doesn't come out. Solid. If I try to pull it out, it doesn't. I mean, if you wanna, let's say you know you 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 arrive at your destination, it's a little hard to kind of push it out, but it's still good. It's it, it's that's the way it's supposed to be supposed to be pretty tough to pull out because you know it, it needs to have the arms and the legs hold it together in order to you know for the phone not to fall out so overall i think this is pretty solid um stand um vent mount again if you're telling me for instance <clears throat> which one do i prefer so let me put these two side by side let me put this on the side real quick twenty dollars ten dollars I'll take this I'll take this because it has the for an extra ten dollars you got the uh, QI charger um, and it's more sturdy and overall I think it's a better quality product than this but again we already reviewed this item so we're gonna get it out of the way we're talking about only for the vent mounts if you're looking for a regular vent mount as a gift or maybe for yourself and uh, you, you like doing the uh, the vent um, uh, vent mount uh, for the car and, and you don't like the actual regular uh, docks then by all means the m pound for about um, eight bucks it's worth it um, I do like the arms 
and the legs they actually hold the phone pretty sturdy um, the only thing that um, kind of worries me a little bit is if you have like for instance like an order box on this thing you know hopefully it holds it you know, it has a nice it has a good space in here so if you get an order box I'm looking at something like maybe like that and it seems yeah I mean it's solid I, I, guys I, I don't think you will have because the, the the order box or those thicker cases have like grooves on the side so that should help the um, mount hold the uh, case uh, together a little bit better so overall I think guys this is a good um, vent mount for the price again standard nothing crazy it's just a regular vent mount but it is worth eight bucks I it I think the it, it has about uh, four and a half um, when it comes to um, rating on it I personally will give it um, about three and a half so um, yes I think it has a four four rating I'll give it about three and a half um, the only, I mean, again, the only reason I'm, I'm not giving it exactly what they say is because um, I reviewed the other one earlier and, and the grips on the other one were a lot better than this one. Um, I kind of felt the other one, I mean, I had to kind of literally shake it till I got tired for it to pop out. This one kind of kind of loosens up a little bit, especially on the bigger phones. But guys, I mean take it as it is it's it's overall if i give it three and a half and, and a lot of the people are giving it about four it, it's a good it's for the price it's i seen horrible ones and they're worth probably triple the money that uh, you're paying for this one you're paying about eight some of them are like 24 30 dollars and and they're, they're they're garbage so if you don't want to waste a lot of money you want to give this a gift or whatever you want to keep it for yourself give it a shot this is actually a good uh, little vent mount Nothing crazy, it's pretty simple. Again, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This was a quick one because um, really nothing else in this. Uh, this is a standard mount. Nothing else uh, comes with this thing. But again, I wanted to kind of show you what I did, a couple of the tests I did. And overall, I think it's a really good um, mount. All right, guys, we're on the road to 100 subscribers. Hopefully you guys are enjoying our videos, liking it. Please comment. Um anything and if you could click on the link if you do decide to buy this item or any other item that we post that actually does help our channel um any little you know um clinks we get from um amazon and affiliates and so forth does help us uh contribute to getting you know more things for the channel for us to kind of you know maybe another stand or maybe more products for us to review and again if you guys find something that you guys are interested in um that uh, you want us to get we'll probably be able to get it ourselves and then unbox it and review it and see how it works and maybe gives you an idea before you go wasting you know your money and uh pretty much not liking the product so again you know that kind of gives us uh, also ideas on what you guys are looking at um that would be very helpful actually guys if you guys could post like hey you know do you mind kind of reviewing this and putting in the link there so we could kind of see what the item is and then probably get it and you know if it's not too expensive go ahead and get in and just review it guys thanks again for everything appreciate all the likes if you've seen to the end of this video thanks again we'll be back with our next video pretty soon we got a lot of things from uh, black friday so a little you know a couple gadgets here and there a couple of uh, speakers so we're going to try to review as much as we can thanks again for everything guys Talk, um, hopefully I'll see you in the next video. See you guys later.